Hey all and welcome to Chainsaw Cat. When I woke up this morning I never thought I'd be ever saying those words but here we are and this is going to be Chainsaw Cat to the rescue which is also looks like an awesome indie game. So let's have a look around. So you've got the go button which is to start the game and a sop sop button and then as you can see in the sop you can upgrade your Chainsaw Cat and you can do awesome stuff such as damage and control and buzz jumps and stuff like that. For now I can't do any of that but you've also got a gallery as well and that looks pretty good so we'll feed to them later on in the video. So let's have a look and see what craziness I'm taking in myself today. So we can press jump to jump and then press a Z again to do a buzz jump. It's like a buzz saw but with a chainsaw and a cat. So that is awesome. I'm going to make loads of cat jokes today, so please don't get hairballs over how bad my puns are. And don't be catty in the comments. That was absolutely terrible. Right, so you need gas to kill enemies, you can jump and use your buzzsaw to kill the enemies, and then collect the coins to upgrade and to get new art in the gallery. As you go on, the gas empties and you start to slow down. So, City Park! Early o'clock, there's a city looking kitten and a load of fishes and one a couple of skirts on. So that seems to be something quite weird and they seem to be a bit humanoid for fishes for my liking. Probably the sardines now cat. So the first thing to do is to come out of the chainsaw cat and this is the most random point of my day so far. If you want to download, uh, play the game uh, then the link is in the description below please check it out along with the developers link to have a look at the developers uh, portfolio and profile and everything to see his work and he is an awesome guy right so if you're too close to the left so you've got to try and keep to the right the only trouble with keeping to the right is you can't see what's coming up so city park that's the tutorial Alright, I'm in the city park. This is the, the first level. And there's a bird, some flame, and like a rhinoceros -y kind of weird creature. And I just lost the game because I've jumped into the bloody thing. I got doomed. Alright, so let's see. The more upgrades you do, the further distance you get. And I needed to have done a bit more of a jump out of there. So I needed to have a bit more Selby's jump. It's a bit strange saying that there's a chainsaw cat. The Selby's glitchy game. Chainsaw Cat. I wonder what hardware store the cat had to get the chainsaw from. I'm trying to make a cat pun, but it's not actually working. Right. Hopefully, oh, I'm trying to grab that fire. I couldn't. I wonder if the cat has nine lives though. I bet it's got a ton of them. It seems that you don't have to get jump, you can also uh, get side or into them and the chainsaw will do all the work but it's probably a bit slower and I'm probably running out of gas a bit more. Alright, let's do one more and then see what upgrades we can beat. So, coming out the phone booth it's Chainsaw Cat and, oh, and he's a dying cat. That was absolutely terrible. I need to die less in this and uh, so okay so I uh, jump and collect the coins and jump oh bloody hell there's an actual two jump there I missed the second jump and now the uh, phone box has turned into yellow which is odd because I'm always used to saying red phone boxes so that phone box is a lie uh, right jumping up and chainsaw up and we've actually survived a bit more than last time it is quite tricky at times Oh, especially making some of these jumps. They are quite tricky jumps, unless it's just me being absolutely terrible. Let's get to see if we can actually buy anything. I don't think we can. We need to just keep on going and see if we can get anywhere, because I'm absolutely doing terrible at the moment. I do apologize. All right, we've got a cat on fire. I saw there's a song called Cat on Fire. I suppose there's Katniss on fire. 
I don't think that fits the spirit of cat puns. Whoa! Bloody hell! If I need to wake up a bit more, I need to smell the coffee. Alright. I need to get some cateen. These are, these are, they're not even from a joke book now. Alright. You're probably burning this to me off the stage. Even though we haven't got a stage on YouTube. You probably would be. Right. Bloody cat. Oh. Oh. Right. I'm doing this thing. I'm being the cat and the chainsaw. Spiritually. To know how to be that animal. Oh. Makes you wonder how the actual cat and chainsaw actually became into being. What's the intro storyline? The cat gets staple or chainsaw onto its chest or oh, I don't know. That'd be actually quite interesting to know. How the cat and the chainsaw collided into one to become the cat saw. That's gotta be his new nickname now, cat saw. Uh, oh. oh okay, because I picked up that there does seem to be a lot of power such as seals and stuff like that. That did seem to help me out then, just then, to be able to seal myself from one drop. So that was quite useful, having that kind of balloon kind of sealed over me. And now I'm just a regular jumping cat it seems like. And I still can go on, even with no chainsaw, just from double jump. So the viable lesson of double jumping, I'm going quite slow. I'm actually surviving, which is actually quite weird for me. To actually be surviving. I've actually got a bit of gas there. Hopefully I don't fart. Well that would be absolutely terrible. Farting King Soul Cat. Probably would go up in a bit of explosion. Uh, double jump. And we're nearly there. We're actually doing alright. We're not dead yet. Losing speed though. We're all slowly crawling. Ugh. I think regular cat has not got the superpowers. Of chainsaw cat. Let's go. Whoa, he just pushed me down a cliff. I need to slowly gather up the gaps to be able to do no jokes there, by the way. To be able to uh, get the chainsaw back. I slowly built up gas once. It wasn't a very pleasant ending. I hope this isn't the same for uh, chainsaw cat because that would be pretty bad. Whoa, and it's the boss. It is the actual clucker himself. It is, I don't know what I'm to call him, but I'm going to call him Mr. Fried Kick. And there we go. And we can actually go to the shop and actually do something for once. But let's have a look at the gallery first and see what uh, there is here. So token 6, price 10. Let's actually just do one token for now. These actually hats as well. I'm going to equip that hat for next time. And do one more round after this. Not enough tokens. Okay, so can we buy tokens? I'm not quite sure. But yeah, you can see for yourself you can collect stuff. Uh, I'm not actually sure how to get a token. I'm sure they'll come up in the main game. So let's have a look around the proper shop. And we can have a look. So jump buzzsaw dashes. You can only have uh, one buzzsaw, buzzsaw dash at a time. So you can do something like double jump with a buzzsaw so it attacks twice. Uh, double jump, you know what not. Double jump is jumping height, control, agility, launch speed, chainsaw damage, sealed, fireballs, gas, and some secret things which I've got no idea of what they're going to be. I think I've actually got seized up some of my coins for some reason. And so I had more money than that. So this chainsaw cat is a bit of a thief as well to my coins sack, which sounds a bit wrong. Right, one more time. And we actually now the mass crane saw cat. Nobody knows about wherever it's gonna go. But nobody knows where this mass chainsaw cat is gonna be who is the mass chainsaw cat. Nobody actually knows for sure. Is he a cat? Is he a dog in disguise as a cat? Or is he just a cat? Find out sometime. It's never gonna happen. It's actually a comic book on this guy. 
Ooh, jump. I do actually talk shit most of the time on our videos. Ooh. Attack. Woo. Got it. Bull saw. And coins. That's actually quite effective actually, just going up to him. I'm doing it. The bull saw is very effective as well. It takes him out in one hit. Bloody hell. The, the trouble is with staying too far near the egg is you've got no idea what's coming next. So it can be quite tricky that way. And I just saw a piggy bank and I saw that would give me coins. Wow, I suck. But one more time. We're going to be the chainsaw cat one more time before I lose all mental sanity. But it's really good and really did. Well, actually that was a forfeit. But it is really good and you should play it and give it a chance if you do like this sort of thing. There's a lot of flash games around. But this one is absolutely crazy in all the right reasons. So you should give it a go. It's a bit of fun. And they've already done a nice job. And who doesn't love a chainsaw cat? So yeah, that's a bit of his praises. I've got no idea what no card means, so if anyone knows, please put it in the comments below. And why did I bloody jump back with us? I'm an absolute idiot. Wow. I failed. Lady bad. Not like I've not failed every single time. Perfect launch. And as you can see, the speed also increases. It's so hard to actually crow. Well, but that's all the good reason about it that it makes the difficulty quite high so it becomes very addictive to try and beat the score you did before if it was so easy that you beat your score first time round and you already did well first time round beat the boss and everything then you won't be playing that as many times as you do so it's very good to try and get that addictive factor in and that's something that all game people should try and do and I'm losing the ability to speak English because of the focus I'm having to do to try and keep up with the chainsaw cat I'm so as well as that with the control upgrades and with the jump upgrades and everything else that it would become quite a bit easier with the upgrades how then bloody hell did he do that jump I've got no idea but yeah that's been chainsaw cat please give it a go it's in the links in the description below also, please like and subscribe to our channel. It really does help. We've been impressed with the amount of help and support we've had on our channel. I think it's about 89, something like that, subscribers. I could be wrong. It's something around there now. So that's been absolutely brilliant. I thank each and every one of you. Without your support, we wouldn't be here making these videos. So yeah, that's been a bit about us as well. But please, as ever, have a look at the developer and see what he does because he's an absolutely awesome guy so props up to the bottom description have a good day have a good day